Anthrax is a bacteria and it has tiny spores that can live in the soil. The way that humans typically get anthrax is when they either butcher an animal that has died of anthrax or they eat the meat of that animal that has died of anthrax. The symptoms are severe actually. They find people with the wounds, especially on the skin. It's indeed a serious problem in Uganda. Apart from causing illness and death among the people uh, in the affected areas, it also disrupts their economic activities. So there is loss of um, lives in addition to loss of livelihood. It's not legal to butcher animals that die suddenly or are sick. The real problem is that you don't know which animals have died of anthrax and which have not. On 16th April 2023, our Minister of Health received a notification from Ibanda District about an outbreak of anthrax, where six cases had been confirmed, including one death. CDC, through the Uganda National Institute of Public Health, deployed fellows from the field epidemiology training program to support the district in investigating and responding to the outbreak. Where we, we may not have the immediate resources to deploy, we usually depend on, on the fellowship program. In previous anthrax outbreak investigations, we usually stop at that point where we find, okay, eating meat from an animal that died suddenly was associated with infection. And what was unusual about this outbreak investigation is that the team took it a step further. They actually went out to say, where did this meat come from? And while they were doing that, they found that there was an entire black market for low quality meat. They gave us evidence about the networks and they were able to give the district a debrief and the district was able to respond. Uh, we made recommendations to the district task force, including prohibiting the illegal meat trade in the affected area and educating the community about anthrax and the dangers of handling and eating meat from animals found dead. We see that there is a change as a result of implementing some of these, these findings that, and the recommendations arising out of the findings. Going deeper into these investigations is so important for us to really be able to effectively stop the outbreaks. The anthrax outbreak was controlled within two weeks following our implementation of our recommendations and the findings of our investigation in regards to the role of illegal meat dealers have since informed uh, the subsequent investigations of anthrax outbreaks in Uganda. To me, that was very positive, something that we can actually carry across even in other, in other districts for other zoonotic diseases.